I really enjoyed the course, um, both the online component and the three-day uh, face-to-face workshop, not only because the workshop provided really good lunch, um, but also it was just a lot more interactive and there were some good practical exercises that I enjoyed. Um, for example, I took away lots of um, tips on exercises including stillness, active mindfulness, and that will help me to implement breaks in my very busy life. And I think that's really important um, according to what I have been taught to prepare myself for that peak performance state. I thought it only applied to sports, but in fact, um, for myself to um, really think clearly and present my, the best version of myself to the team, I really need to be in that state. That's awesome. Um, I also enjoyed learning about setting culture for a group. And I guess the timing couldn't have been better because I have just been promoted to be a group leader. Um, I haven't had a group meeting yet. So everything that I've learned about setting culture for the group and ensuring that we have common values, common goals, I think that would be very handy. Awesome. So what's your top takeaways? My top takeaway message is, um, number one, a good, um, an authentic leader um, will inspire the group and um, create a culture that everyone's comfortable with and happy to work, um, happy to work in. Um, my second top um, message is that everyone has strength. Um, so instead of calling some traits weaknesses, we can consider them to be lower strength um, and hopefully our upper strength or top strength can help to pull those uh, lower strengths through. I found Elizabeth and Christine to be very dynamic and engaging people to work with um, and they're extremely knowledgeable in what they teach. And I have to say the course is not what I expected of a leadership training course. I felt that they were really exploring um, our Pers not personalities, but our personal stories and trying to draw things out of us. It's like a, a personal development course rather than leadership training. Well, number one, I'm going to set up a team meeting <laughs> and uh, discuss um, culture setting in a very creative manner. And um, I plan to read over my notebook, actually. There are so many tips and references to books and video clips. I just want to have some more time to absorb everything. Um, and actually implement the practical tips, which I mentioned before, awesome. the stillness and the mindfulness. Um, I would really recommend this course to other researchers. Um, even if you don't think that you're leading a group as such, you're actually still able to lead yourself, if not the students or the research assistants around you. Um, I also find that this course will be very helpful to the doctors in the hospital because they're constantly supervising students, uh, junior doctors, and I think this sort of um, awareness of what an authentic leader, um, how an authentic leader works, uh, will really help them to engage and train the younger doctors better.